Welcome in, everybody. Welcome to the Pours and Podcast. I am your host today. This is Jared Seahorn. Why are you giving me Price is right. I gave it, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Why you yeah. cut off my prime the time finger, introduction? Like you, got right. <laughs> you got LP. Finger, to my C-Zack. left. Yeah. And this is oh, Jeopardy. Feel, feel, feel. And to my far left. DJ Soup. All right. And we got episode, what is it? Hurry, 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 hurry. 22? 32. 322. Oh, that was off the we top, too. 322. For too long, Three, actually. I'm ready to quit. Like, what are we two. doing? I got eight. Hold on, guys. Yeah, slow down. I'm ready, ready to quit. So <laughs> yeah, like, like, I just I, got here, man. That's your fault. Like, we got to do at least 300 more. Matter of <laughs> fact, your energy is probably why I'm ready to quit right now. You know what I'm saying? Or maybe we need to change scenery Silk's or something. First day, we are about to change. They See, I wasn't going to yeah, say yeah, something. Yeah. So, Silk's first day, y'all. This is Silk's first official day. Mm-hmm. Bro was supposed to get here an hour and a half ago. All right. Yeah. What time is it? It, it is one fifteen. <laughs> yeah, I was supposed to be yeah. here. Actually. I couldn't even get the hot boy mix. I couldn't, I supposed, couldn't even get our mix in. Couldn't today. even get Damn. the hot boy mix because niggas. Because like, you know. Bro. My bad, man. My energy been off all week. Damn. <laughs> now, hold on. Okay, you can't say you that. You can't say that, yeah. Friday, you was rocking. Okay, yeah. You had, oh, one, you had one chick yeah. in there doing a dance from, uh, from what's the movie? Oh, uh, say the last day. <laughs> nah, not what say the last day. The black girl from uh, Wesley Snipes. Stop. If remember again, if you New don't mind, Jack not City. holding yeah. the mic. New Phil, Jack City. If, if oh, you don't mind, not holding the mic. Yeah. What was her name in that movie? Mm-hmm. Uh-uh, Angina or something like that. When Angina? Angina. Nah, Angina. nah, Angina. Hold on. No, Angina is from. <laughs> there was a character in a movie named Angina. I'm trying to. Nah, it, it wasn't that. That wasn't New Jack City. Nah, it wasn't. That's an information. What was it? Look up Angina. Anyway, yeah. I thought that was a heart condition that you got before you got a heart attack. moving the same way. She I had said, the dance oh, down shit. packed and yeah. everything. Yeah, she yeah. was getting hurt. Hey, uh, I pulled up on y'all boys. Uh, yeah, and I didn't know Tipsy Lounge was like, it's intimate, but... It was it was like it wasn't too packed and it wasn't nah. like it was jumping. It can it can get really, really packed, but I think this weekend was just everybody was kinda chilling. Yeah, and it was then chill. Like, it was everybody cool. had went out the night before for Halloween. Yeah. So yeah, Friday, right. it was still a nice crowd right, though. Nice but crowd. I appreciate y'all boys. Now pulling look up, here, man. I only got one gripe. Okay. I got there, my man wouldn't let me in because I had shorts on. I didn't even know that was a thing. And I ain't yeah, I was, I was like, oh shit, I just I'm pulling up on my partner eat a DJ. So, oh, uh, well, shit, I can walk you in there to the booth, but you got to stay there. Like, you got to stay I, there? I'm like, I just wanted to say what's up anyway. Bro, what? But, yeah, but I, yeah. I ain't but never we heard was all that right rule. there by the booth anyway, so. Right. No, yeah, it, it was cool. you weren't even dressed like I know, a gangster right? or nothing yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, you had shorts on. I, I mean, he dressed like a gangster. <laughs> What was he? Was he, he wasn't dressed like this. Oh, okay, let's say good. On Friday. Like, I had a little button up on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Right now, yeah, he yeah, looks, yeah. He yeah. just got all worked. The corduroy I've <laughs> ever seen. Like, man, I just left a deacon's meeting, yeah. man. <laughs> That boy you feels, the deaconess, huh? what, what, what do you and the deaconess discuss at your meeting, brother? We want to know that you lay hands on this young woman to make sure that the spirit of the Lord was in her. Let us know. No, nah, man, the deacons meeting. It was a good meeting, bro. What man, do y'all do at the deacons feel, meeting? Man, they just missile. giving me the game. Of the deacon. Lord? No. <laughs> no. Nah, I looked up. They I looked gave up. him the game on how to misappropriate the building fund. Yeah, yeah. So what, <laughs> why isn't the building done, Phil? The building. The, the, field, the building fund has been going on since 1986. <laughs> they done had a, a, a image of how much money they need to raise in the same spot since the 80s. Nigga, What's I going look, on? I look up. D, uh, Silk went to his R&B oh, set. Oh, man. I look up at Phil. He getting rolled up like this. <laughs> I gotta play it cool. That nigga's right? playing it cool. Yeah. She, hey, she, you know. hey, she is cool. She got a drink in her time. hand. She doing her thing. Yeah. Like, you know, you know how they get into it. God is good. <laughs> All, the time. All the time. God is good. God is good. That's why I said, hey, man. Bro. Phil is God one of the coolest deacons good. I've ever nah. met, bro. It was one point during that RB set, I started playing shit for women. Yeah. Yeah. And JC tapped me. He was like, hey, man. Yeah. Feel in trouble, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. What was that song? What was that song? Because uh, that's if. when they getting me. It was if. It was yeah, if. Yeah, okay. Yeah, well, who's singing that Child. song? Destiny Child. If? Uh, yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. Don't yeah. play that, that they... bitch again. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, all the niggas be looking at me like, bro. Come on, I tell you, I got y'all, man. I got y'all, man. I was like, now you got to play so-and-so, but I forgot what I told you. 
I forgot. I was like, what you now you gotta play this. Well, yeah. you you probably hate when people do that. In the de- no, 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 I was being oh, funny about it. I was being funny. Be honest. Yeah, no. Don't you hate I was when people being funny. Being tell funny. you how to do your set? He was being funny, but yes, that yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, man, you gotta play. You gotta play. Beat it, man. Bro. It's Halloween. Yeah, you know? I'm like, bro. Do I come sit at your cubicle right, and right, type right. your emails right. for you? I like, hate when you be like, oh no, instead of that, let's do this workout. Like, motherfucker, I programmed it for this. Shut him up. Shut yeah. up. So why did you do that to him then? Is nah, it, nigga, yeah, that was yeah, a joke, was nigga. Because he had played that song. I was like, oh, you got to flip it to the guys. Yeah, yeah, I forgot yeah. what song I said, though. What's it was that funny. old ass song you was playing, though? Uh, <laughs> what? No, so I go I go from... So I go like from Tennessee. I went from Iv to oh, Tennessee, Tennessee Whiskey. Whiskey. Tennessee Whiskey. And then uh, I'd, rather go, I'd Rather Be Blind by Beyonce. It's the same... Yeah, right, right. Same right. instrumental, basically, yeah. yeah. Nah, that's fine. But yeah, everybody was in that bitch singing. Yeah, it was good. Phil was getting sang too. Yeah. <laughs> and you still decided to come an hour and a half late <laughs> on your first it day. It all comes back oh, to we're, that. This is, we're staying on this for most of the show. We're yeah. going to get off of it for a little bit. It did. But I'm coming back to <laughs> you being two hours late on your first day. <laughs> I don't understand. Wait, how did I go from an hour to an hour and a half? I don't know. You tell me why t- you weren't here. Like, I we got to figure that I ain't out. Gonna lie. I ain't going to lie, Silk. When I got here, you text. And then he said something about we watching the game. I was getting ready to walk out the door. No, no, well, yeah. you don't have to tell what happened. I know we got to tell. Yeah, we got to Like I looked up again. He said something again while we were watching the game. I was like, damn, it's been thirty minutes. Okay, and then, and then I said, we're starting right now. <laughs> yeah. I don't, I don't he care. kept saying shit. I'm like, oh, that's nigga. He ain't here. All right. <laughs> <laughs> shit. I was like, like we're starting. I was right. talking to you, Bell. Ask them. He was He's not here. He was. I was immediately ready to tear up the contract. <laughs> <laughs> like the agreement was null and void at this point, bro. Too late. You the know how dry. you can annul a marriage after like 15 right. days? Right. Like, that's what dry. we need to do. The ink so is we dry. need to figure that out. And then I need to figure out where to get Phil's fit from. <laughs> like for real. Hey, you would look cool in that. I would look in cool black. in that. I Anybody need a black would, one. it's Levi's, dog. It's Levi's, bro. Dungarees? No, no, no. I, I will commend Phil, man. He makes the most normal brands look. <laughs> Yeah. Like it's something. Yeah. I got and, what the French call. Oh. <laughs> Je ne sais quoi. Je ne sais quoi. <laughs> I, it ain't even sway, bro. It's that French shit. Yeah, that I got, got that shit, bro. <laughs> uh, that is fact, when, bro. When did you realize you had it? Oh, uh, they started giving me shit for free in third ward. For real. Right. Oh, God. Yeah. I was like, damn. I'm, I'm, you talking about style. <laughs> I, that, you was talking about style. As far as like style, no, or just like, like when you when you knew like you was there. I'm the Don. Something. I'm the Don. Yeah, probably about. <laughs> <I'm gonna say laughs> the fact that he really taking this shit serious. This is one of the most ridiculous conversations. I am joking. We ever had on the pod. Hey, that's it. Funny. No, the I fact. Ain't joking. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta take it back. This, this is the most ridiculous conversations because LP ever had. Let's take it back for yeah. the new listeners, this right? This is ridiculous, bro. Yeah. We only know about the mystique of Phil when we first met Phil, at least mm. me and LP. This is ridiculous, okay. bro. Because <laughs> KC knew him already. We didn't know. We should, he, and then KC presented it like, man, I don't know what this nigga do. I don't know what. <laughs> he from Third Ward. Everybody <laughs> know him. But he cool people. Let's just try him out. Let's see. And then me she and LP was like, all right. <laughs> <laughs> and then, but he was all of that. That's what Casey LP was hurt. He was hurt. Yeah, he was, he was hurt. hurt. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. that's, but that was. So you said I didn't, it's funny. I didn't know that feel until maybe in the past few years. I met Phil hooping, so I just know him there. There's many faces of me. I'm not gonna lie. To you. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't already talked about being in spots and feel here, kill here, come feel by itself. Mm-hmm. He don't come with unless it's with his brothers. Mm-hmm. And, and then, them niggas are a gang. <laughs> Yeah, if they ain't there, they ain't there. Gang, bro. Like, I'm like, like it, it, it. man, what Q at? Oh, but that's he the best way. people to. No, oh, no, yeah. no. I'll be with my brother. You know, you got to be back. Yeah, bro, you got to be back. Yeah, but we're not a gang, though. No. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, like we're civilian blacks. Like, like we're civilian blacks. We don't know if y'all are civilians or not. Like, or have y'all done criminal activity? Like, I don't want you to incriminate yourself to do it. We was in, the, we was in that Spanish hood we was in. Uh-huh. I was like, man, we safe. You was in Galita Park? No. <laughs> no, nah, we was on the South East Side. We was in the First War, Second War. Oh, oh, uh, 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 the block yeah. party. Yeah, yeah, but I'm just saying, it, that shit yeah. felt cool. Like, it was Y'all was, y'all was, yeah, we was felt like y'all was in good hands. Yeah, it was good hands. Hey, you cool. know how, it's just like, um, you from Oklahoma. Like, no if you go back home, everybody knows. Yeah. So, Third Ward, Yellowstone, yeah. South Park, man, it's like a community. Everybody know, especially if you done done something with yeah. you, you gonna be known. I got a nigga that 
my nigga Boo from Sunnyside. Everybody know him. Yeah, but it's, it's a like, difference between knowing. Why is there a a boo everywhere? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, on, on, on. There's a boo everywhere. Damn, Get your point. Um, it's the difference between knowing uh -huh. and having respect for that person. Yeah, like you, you could have did something great back in the day. Like yeah. Vince Young did great things. I don't know if he respected in harm. Club I mean, he like just that. got knocked out too. So, I'm just saying. That's know. what I'm saying. So he got, he got sucker punch. He got sucker punch. He got sucker punch. I'm just saying. Side. I'm just using them as an yeah, example. Yeah, 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 there yeah, are sure. people that did great things, but we don't know if they're respected. I like how you are respected when we go on the yard at TSU or like whoever. Why? I done seen Vy move around, man. I'm just using him as an example. No, no, no. I know. But yeah. Why is Boo? Uh huh. A synonymous name in all black communities. I think it's easy. Like that's a yeah. easy black. name to yeah, boo, boo, black. 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 It's a black in everything. Black run the Savoy. I got here. A, yeah. That's his name. Black. Yeah. I, mm -hmm. I got a boo as a partner. I boo. Got a poo poo as a cook. Poo -poo. Yeah, I poo. got a poo poo too. Uh, Scooter is me. She is my yeah. nickname. Scooter. Why do we do that as blacks? Can we not get better elevated nicknames? Nah, that's cool. I mean, I, yeah. it's, it's yeah. unique. All right, all right. Smoke. Smoke is not unique. That's that's what, it is. I'm just saying, like, that's you ain't what, gonna find it, like, uh, JJ or whatever it is. That's what makes us us, though. Yeah. Like, I think naturally we're just a creative people. But we're not creative if there's always one in every community. That you're well, not creative. We're recreating. Why is everyone a little well, rapper? But our community is our community to the outside that's world. Like it's creative. A, uh, it's there's so a little pistol starter. There's yeah. a little way. There's a little. There's a little I ain't little never met a little pistol bro. starter. Like, <laughs> nah, LA got all the nicknames. We got like we got know, a lot of nicknames. Here, though, we got the we traditional do. one. Yeah. We but do. why got so like nicknames wild and blacks? nicknames? Why can't we just use our names? I don't we, know. We do. Not really. Even you my don't use your name. It's my name though. It's abbreviated. But it's still not your name. Yeah, that's true. True. It's not. It's my name. I can't, it's not. It's I can't, not your name. It, it, it's not. I, I know you got not. another nigga name. I know it's not. I got three niggas names in mine. <laughs> what are you talking I, about? So, yeah, you got a yeah. double lot of times. Well, I, I can count on one hand the amount of times people have called me Corey in the past, like, five years. Wow. Most people don't know that's your name. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't know what we your didn't know name you had, We didn't know you had a family I, until, I like, even, six weeks ago. I introduced myself as Silk at this point. Till today. No, what's going on? We tripping at this point. Talking about you got a family like that is crazy to me. Like, <laughs> how are you DJ it all night with a family, bro? That's that is funny. insane. That is like, damn, you gotta, <laughs> gotta make some money, man. <laughs> got to, gotta make some money to pay for these. <laughs> <motherfuckers>. <laughs> that is fair. That is fair. My robot yet. ain't came in the mail yet, so I still gotta work. <laughs> damn, but they're engineers that work all night. But bro. there is a silk in every community too. There's a silk yeah, somewhere yeah. everywhere. You know, that it ain't nasty. one like him, yeah, though. Yeah, yeah, nigga, that nigga usually say, a nasty, nigga deadbeat motherfucker. That to that girl say, I'm silk. Yeah. Man, that lady said it. Pop over and stuff. That's your partner. That's your partner. And I never forget that shit. That nigga say, I'm silk. That nigga kind of rolled his neck. That hoe say, that hoe say, damn. She said, that's your partner. That's my nigga, man. Man, that shit was funny, bro. <laughs> yeah, Silk that's, is, that's, that's probably the best nickname. Though. Nah, for real, for real. But you gotta, yeah. you Who gotta have a stand nickname? to that. Uh, the Fundy. So basketball. Mm, oh, basketball. Where it came from. Yeah, mm -hmm. I got that name. Oh, I thought fundy. it came from the hoes. I don't like it. Nah, that, nah I mean, it, it okay. it's a basketball nickname. Yeah. That ain't nothing, bro. Like you know, damn, the niggas was called. Made a few jump shots. He's silky. Like that's crazy. Like, they call you silky or just silky? Oh, he's silky smooth. It was it was silk. They nah, would say silky. That's a little. That's I'm just saying yeah, the nigga yeah. on the mic was on. Oh, this boy yeah. right here's new silky smooth. I'm gonna just call him silk. Nah, my my the first nickname they called me was Pogo Stick. Oh man, I, said, I remember that, bro. Hey, I went to nah. I went right to the table. I said, "Hey, bro, <laughs> hey, no, yo, you better find nigga, something nigga, that is not about to stick." Bro, 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 <laughs> Hell no! Nah. Oh, but he yeah, poking yeah, that hoe, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah man. <laughs> But yeah, it came from hooping. It didn't Man, come from the a hose. What the fuck are we talking about? Yeah, Life. I don't know. All right. Life. Speaking of hooping, <laughs> um, there's major beef right now in Toronto. Wow, <laughs> bro. The, the Toronto Goons <laughs> and Drake. They're courtside now. Courtside. I didn't know they was courtside. Stare in down Debo of the league. That's crazy. For the entire game. They didn't sit down the entire game. <laughs> and then as DeRozan was leaving the court, they said, get the fuck out of here, bitch. Damn. Imagine Craig and Smokey stared down Debo as he the whole ride down game. the street on his beast cruise all day and call him a pussy. What is going on with Drake, bro? What, what is happening right now? First, I don't get this. This is my man's job. He's not allowed to come to Toronto? Can I? The first thing is, DeRozan is a professional basketball player. Correct. Drake, you are a professional musician. No. The niggas you with not. But that's where niggas go wrong. 
like having the wrong people around. Oh, well, no, we're not gonna do that. No, I'm they've saying been around. They, no, they I, a part I get of the it, business. But the whole thing, the whole thing with Drake and this whole Kendrick thing was, you're not this. You not this guy. You not the dude to sit front row at a basketball game and really talk shit like on some disrespectful shit. It ain't no. Oh, that's a brick. That's a bad pat. Nah, he talking about get out of here, bitch. Yeah. Come on, man. <clears throat> yeah, Drake. Drake too emotional right now. Uh, Very. Bro, gotta he gotta chill, bro. Um, I get it. I think he knew. I think him and DeRozan had a pretty good friendship. Um. I know him and LeBron had a good friendship. He got LeBron tatted on his arm. So whoever showed up on Kendrick's side, he 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 has a real problem with you at this point. But bro, it don't look real. like him being upset or trying to look thugging like he going to do something. It looked bad for you, bro. It looked corny. Like yeah. stop it. Bro. It's forced. We, I mean, you just bro, got a chain that says certified baddie made. Bro, yes, he has a chain that they made for him that's multicolored that says certified. You can't be certified baddie and then be ready to box it right after. That is crazy to me. It's yeah. like, bro. Unless you really. Unless you really. Unless, in the I'm just saying, no, unless you really just secure with yourself that you got him. Like, uh, you got it like that. Bro, unless LA, you. LA like, ride with DeRozan, bro. And you got to do business. From, no, you got to do like, business in LA, bro. You're going to have to have another show out there. You got to. You have to go to LA for LA a show. Ride with the Rose. No, they mess he, with that boy, man. So they, it's like he he mad at all the wrong people. Your beef is with Kendrick. Well, bro. well, I, see, I'm on. I can. We can talk both sides. I get oh, what you're saying as far yeah, as you know. Like, y'all was, like, show, doing y'all was on we that doing. side. We doing what we, we doing right yeah. now. You know, when the big corporation come or whoever, whatever we do, and we blow up, like really blow up. Mm. And the people that we know and move around in the city and, you know, I like somebody, how you said when, too. Huh, what? You said when we blow. I like I'll that. So just like, we gonna, yeah, I'm going to be off the pot. Uh, I'm just saying, we know the hands we shake all the time. We yeah. know the people we talk to all the time. Yeah. We know. We, so it's just like, yeah, if if some shit go down and we and we got beef with this crew over here or whatever, and then you, I see you over there with them and you from the city or and we've been... Nah, well, shit. But it's but, but it's t- different when it was at his job. Yeah, huh? yeah. Like, you this, it's, it's one you thing if I see job. Some, yeah. if I see someone at faces that <laughs> don't mess with Silk because yeah. Silk remixed some shit wrong, <laughs> and then now Oof. we got beef over that. That's different. But yeah. that's his job. Yeah. He's like flying in to perform his job. Well, no, no, but that's that's where I that's mean. That's not Drake's job. Drake, that that's, no, I mean no. Actually, it is. He is the ambassador, but that's not. <laughs> but it, you're not supposed to be there making beef for the organization. You're an ambassador. Yeah, you're talking on the on the at halftime when his little Drake segment. Yeah, talking he's about I'll tear down his tell, jersey if they crawl, um, if you put the rose put in the rose out. He's a goof. Ah, you, you, you shouldn't do that, man. Do that's that, crazy. Man, yeah, like, I think it's Drake. Yeah, I think it's too much. Like I think it's corny, fan, but I don't. I don't been. limit. I don't limit the. I don't limit that type of shit because that's what you're seeing. You're gonna start seeing commentating like that with a Marv Arbor and then like a whatever a Snoop Dogg. Mm-hmm. Like you are gonna start seeing shit like that. Yeah, but I'm so I, it's corny. Like I don't like it. From the air's grievances out right there yeah. is unprofessional. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. unprofessional. It's corny. Like, you supposed to be talking about the It's gonna be game, shit bro. like that though. Yeah, and you, and you know to be honest, the Rosen's jersey. Deserves to be in the Raptors. You know why it's corny? It's being posted in on Toronto. ESPN. That's, you know what I mean? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. He knew that's, it was going to do that's that. That's what bro. I'm saying. Like, mm. you're going to start seeing they that everything is social media now. Everything yeah. is social. Everything is okay. And then the reporter asked DeRozan about what Drake said. Like, mm-hmm. oh, Drake called you a pussy at the game. What you think about that? And then he put it on his stories that uh, Drake did. That no, DeRozan did Debo. that. Craig and yeah. uh, <laughs> Smokey. Smokey. Oh, I didn't even he, see that. I was just yeah, making it. He out. also oh, put that's... on something else on his stories. I can't remember, but he did like two yeah. back to back. Like I'll address this when I see him. Like yeah. DeRozan ain't no punk, yeah. man. Like no. what, what no, is he doing? I told y'all this before the game. I'm um, before Don't we let started. That we jump shot for KC you. was at the game. We was at the game when he got into it with Dylan Brooks. Mm-hmm. Okay, that last season, uh, and we was with his people at the game. And the Rosen people. Yeah. Okay. His people. Yeah. And they was like, shit. 
That nigga ain't playing. <laughs> that, nigga, that nigga is not playing with Dylan Brooks. Because nah. they yeah, were saying nah. Dylan Brooks is tripping. Because he, Dylan Brooks, know better. You showing out. Canadian mm. blacks. It, it always Canadian go back to Canadians. Canadians. Yeah, Canadian, Canadian blacks. Canadian blacks. It always go back to the Canadian blacks, the Canadian black. You found the root. There's something with the Canadian <laughs> hey, blacks. We was talking about it's that free health care. <laughs> 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 nah, it's true. the Canadian <laughs> blacks, bro. It's something about that. <laughs> I don't know what it is. It's got to be in the water. Maybe they don't have fluoride in their water like uh, we do. <laughs> It's got to be. What else we got in our water? Um, arsenic. Lead. Shit. Lead. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Galveston. Uh, poison. Uh, uh, a lot of shit. And bro, our asses is on dying, the side of the bro. house drinking out the uh, waterfall. Hey, dying, hey, you, know, you know what's funny? A person will judge you off the type of bottle of water you drink. Yeah, if you drink Dasani, don't talk That's to crazy. me. You what type of white mean? people you be around? Just nah. people, people. What's wrong with Dasani? Yeah, this said, is good. Said, is it, you might as well Aquafina. drink out the side of the house. Man, I don't care. I'll, I'll drink from <laughs> that's me. really so, better. So water. It, how how did they get it? Like, how do they continue to give because us this money? If, capitalism. Damn. Yeah. Can so, what is wrong with Dasani? Like for real? I don't it know. Tastes, I, it's I not like good. shit. It tastes bad. Water tastes like water. Nah. Mm. I thought that too until nah. I had Dasani oh, and then I had, had Aquapana. Boss, I've had Voss. Aquapana changed my life. I'm not gonna lie. I had Aquapana too. What's the other one that just changed my life? All that shit. Man, y'all over there spend $36 for a case of water. It's crazy. Mm -mm. I only drink Aguapana at the, at the bar. Did like, you get it for free? Yep. Now I'm telling. Now, now put, put the camera I, on. Yeah. I, I went to the same which bar. I went to the same which bar. I went to the right there on the same <laughs> same which bar. He said, hey, watch my Aquapano. I said, nigga. <laughs> shout, shout, watch out, shout out to my bartenders, man. I love y'all, so, man. Like, watch my pussy. <laughs> what? 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 Where? How? Watch your Aquapano? That's what you said? <laughs> I gotta go watch my Aquapana. You know, I, I, knew, I, I, knew, I knew a woman named Aquapana. Whoa. She, yeah, I damn, think her damn, name was Aquapana. She sounded like she got a rumper. <laughs> <laughs> she said a rumper. She was kind of stacked, too. Aquapana sound it. like she go answer the door. That's one of the wildest black names. That's like Angina. Angina is a heart uh, thing, bro. Like you're about to have a heart attack. There was a that's oh, a stripper I, from House Party. House Party. Yeah. That's what it was. That's yeah. what it was. She party yeah. Yeah. House she gave niggas heart attacks out here. Yeah. Man, she <laughs> had that ass, boy. Yeah, she, bro. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, that yeah. was real, too. That, that was, was real. Yeah, that, that was her 90s. That was 90s bad. That was 1995. That was crazy. I used to rewind that part off. Like, I remember that shit, bro. She got that bitch right in front of Grandma. That was crazy. Damn, what was her name again? Who? Angina. 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 Yeah, yeah. She, that shouldn't have been loud on the scene, bro. Yeah. We was too young to be watching that. Hell nah, no. that nigga Chris Tucker at the door at that hole, <laughs> digging in his pants said, for that money. I don't know yeah. you, man. <laughs> man. <laughs> Same time. That ain't Chris Tucker was on fire. What? What? <laughs> that shit was funny, man. That was a funny ass movie though. Yeah, yeah. House Party Three. Immature. That might be one we need to. We do. gotta go. Yeah, we, we, gotta, we really gotta, gotta do that. We got, My we toe jam. We really gotta hit it. Dog. Oh man, that nigga funny. Michael nigga Collier funny. is one of the funniest yeah, he people funny. in the world. Bro. Yeah, he's a classic. He black. was. He, and he does. Yeah. He did crack for thirty years and was functioning. And, and always had a fresh suit Samuel too. Jackson too though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a bunch of crack. Legendary crackheads. Gotta be the next level. I gotta try it. You gonna be like that scientist? These are successful blacks, bro. Nah, they are. There's a side. Yeah, he did meth. For, he did uh, a couple drugs. We got to look at the ratio of successful blacks and yeah. everybody I'm going to be successful in whatever I do. So I think crack will be taking the There's only like five of them. I can see I him think, with the pipe. <laughs> he hit that hole. Oh, this isn't bad at all. <laughs> Y'all saw how I did the hot chip. That's what I'm bro, saying. I, I like think, shit on the fence, bro. I think I can take down crack, you? bro. Yeah, I think I can take down crack. Hey, 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 wait, that bro. is not an exaggeration. Yeah. That is not an exaggeration. I, 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 I swear to God, I threw up three times in like 10 minutes. He said I could beat crack. Yeah, I think I could beat crack. Hey, that's no lie. That's no lie. I think we need to do LP purse crack, bro. I think we need to do that. Bro, don't I'm do serious. that shit, but bro, bro, we I'm took a... that chip silk, bro. <laughs> I know. Hey, you take us to the next the, level. The, the hoe was black. We can sponsor it. It was a black it's... chip. It was green when you touched it. That's gonna get us canceled. Get some sponsors, bro, and then we gonna get the uh, uh, LPDA, sponsors. Nino LP Brown, versus nigga. crack. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be an experiment for the world. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Fuck that. I think I need to do. I'll be absent that day. Nah, bro. That that that. I think I need to do at least a week of crack. As I'm, I'm thinking about that chip, bro. The chip. I ain't seen nobody be able to do the chip. Bro. Only thing that's gonna happen, your your eyes just gonna turn yellow as fuck. I don't mind. I'll lose a liver over this. Yeah. If it's gonna take us to the next level, but it level, ain't gonna phase you. You ain't it's gonna, gonna be a phase. Nigga gonna come in here with eyes like Michael Jordan. Get on that crack. Get on that crack. Get on that pipe for all week. But if it take us to the next level, it's worth it. Man, man. I'm passing through anyway, so that's all right. Good. I mean, if I gotta do a little crack to make it, I'm gonna do it. 
Uh, yeah. My family yeah. is my family will be fine, bro. This gonna be a lot of bleeps in this. Movie. I'm leaving this in it. Uh, I'm talking uh, about yeah. what the, the yeah. you can say crack. You can definitely say crack. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Crack, 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 YouTube crack, be crack, tripping. Crack, crack. <laughs> say dick I, on NBC. I'm talking about like, I'm talking about YouTube. <laughs> no, we just can't show me using the crack on the show. But uh, yeah. <laughs> he could be high off the crack. Yeah, on the I'm show. definitely gonna be high on crack during the show. I think don't. I, Kids. I think that's a reasonable oh, kids don't do drugs. Matter of fact, I'm gonna do crack drugs. election special. I think that's a reasonable way to bring in the election. They still got dare. Dare, yeah. Dare failed though. Dare failed. Dare is the worst thing. Okay, no, okay. This, no, this, dare this, made this, me use drugs. But this is the part. About? This is the part where John, John, listen to me. This is the part where you got to put. The thoughts and opinions of yeah, LP you gotta, you do not have, represent uh, the Poor Horseman oh, yeah, podcast. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Dare was the worst campaign ever. It no, made all us use drugs. Bro, everybody who had a Dare in their school, everyone was using the dope right after they left that class. <laughs> Like they was, literally, they was literally smoking blunts right after you left it took, that class. It took me about Dare 12 years like to do like that. Yeah. I think it was Reagan. Dare to keep your kids yeah, on Yeah, it was yeah. Reagan. Yeah. I, I like the that, t-shirt. That the yeah. swole lion. I had the t-shirt. The lion yeah. was smoking dope after too. Like he, he, that was nah, a no terrible Smokey the bear and that nigga. But, but Smokey was forest fires. Like yeah. that ain't nothing. Bro. But then you had the camel nigga. Who? Giving us loose. Giving us cigarettes. Yeah. Yep. Yep. He was called Joe. Well, he looked like Jay-Z. Joe, uh, Joe Smooth. Joe Campbell. Joe Campbell looked like Jay-Z. Don't point at me, fool. That's your Because <laughs> <laughs> you're about to get back in your car, and you're going to be mad at me. That nigga said, you look like Jay-Z. You ain't doing that shit the whole time home. And you're going to be listening to all your favorite Jay-Z hits. So, Imaginary <laughs> player. <laughs> oh, my God. Bro, they That's used to give funny. us cartoons and make us use drugs. Nah, yeah. They were selling that shit to mm. us. But, but. Did y'all that, have Don't that, Follow Me come to y'all school? Don't Follow, follow Me. Don't Follow Me. What is that? What is yeah. that? It was a program where they would have uh, inmates. Nah, that's some Midwest shit. We come to your school. This is, this is right Shut there in Nashville. Up, man. <laughs> they came like and they told their stories. Shit. It was like Scared Straight, but it was like the elementary school version. But you they seen just that video? Standing. Of yeah. 98 Scare Straight with that dude. It's like, look at me, motherfucker. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> nah, yeah. I used seen to that? watch Scare Straight. Man, nah, Scare Straight. I used one. to want to fight some of them niggas. Nah, nah, bro. Y'all, so, y'all fight. seen the Boondocks episode when they went to the jail? Yeah. So that episode was based off. Oh, okay, that, okay, that, okay. okay. Scare okay. Bro, Scare Straight was not effective either. Like, cause not just, really. Not, and now well, you can't do it. Now, now, now the crash house switches on you. These They're niggas like, is okay. crash house. They don't give a fuck. Yeah, my brother, they, my brother, they, they took like, my brother to be here next week. My older brother. <laughs> it didn't work. Huh? It didn't work. He came home talking about it. He's like, man, they tried to uh, put us in the cell. Nah, shit. that ain't gonna work, nah. bro. Now, it ain't gonna work because it ain't real. Now, yeah, you gotta yeah. really do something. You really to gotta yeah. scare these yeah. little niggas. This nah, was like, they really not scared. This was of like shit. '97. He went. I'm scared of young niggas. Blacks. In '97 was wild too. Oh, yeah, the '90s was a wild. My brother time. went. He came back home, and I remember him talking about it. They like, sent KC to no, no my no, older brother. Yeah, he brother. was 17 at the time. <laughs> Damn. They, they the only thing I fear on that was their last resort. Nah, was he wilding like that? He was in the streets, but he went and came home. He was like, man, shit, man, he just tripped. Let me sit in the jail. See, they need that nigga I was in jail with. That nigga said, you was actually in jail, I'm though. going to slap everyone in jail, <laughs> and no one's going to do nothing nah, but you wasn't, that, that You was really in jail. Yeah, I was really no, in jail. No, we now. talking this about the program. So oh, okay, well, but they did you get slapped? In there with him. <laughs> <laughs> man, that nigga started slapping niggas, man. <laughs> he ain't making it around to you? Man, when he got to me, he said, I don't know what's something about you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't know, I put this on God. Hey, hey, man, get, get the fuck out of here, dog. Jesus Christ. It's something about you. It just feels French. I got it, French, man. Hey, hello. The nigga said it's something about you. You got that anointing on you. I just can't slap you, brother. Man, that nigga. I just can't do it, brother. I just can't slap you. I just slapped everybody in, but it's something about you. I put this on everything, bro. Dog. When the nigga, when when the nigga slapped the nigga before me, my ass cheeks was wet, bro. I'm sweating so hard. Man, that nigga got to me. Nigga about 6'8", <laughs> he cut. He already know he going for 30. <laughs> Man, he say, bro, you a cool little nigga. Did you ask somebody hey, next bro, to you after that? In you my know brain, what? I want to say, thank you. Nah, <laughs> nah was somebody after you? Nah. Oh, yeah, he, he got slapped got the nigga next to you. He continued to sweat. <laughs> Till they call us in the courtroom. And I had to tell my mom, my mom about this shit. That nigga went out. <laughs> Mom, this is it's a real killer, bro. Right? This whole he is slapping. Man, he slapped the third nigga oh. so hard, bro. <laughs> the eighth nigga started crying, bro. 
Bro, I'm but for real. Hurt. Why y'all didn't jump him, bro? See, bro, like, like, y'all, like, 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 so he know like feeling he, it on the toe. About to fight back. Nah, they I gotta get... fight back, bro. I'm bro, sorry, bro. Bro, like, pass me up, bro. Hard, this nigga. Go oh, ahead, tell oh my god, nah, that nigga, nigga said like it's I... something about you, bro. My heart was. I'm just so gonna fast. slap the next nigga. Yeah, that's Man, crazy. Bro. You should have started right. slapping niggas with him. I like, should have been. You should have been on the yeah, he looked at you crazy. Him. Hit that nigga. Man. Nah, you, you didn't hit him hard enough. Go again. Go again. Slap him with the left this time. We get the your tag team. Yo, man, that bitch nigga made me make get it. Mr. Alize right there. Day, oh, bro. my God. I went home and prayed. So thank you, God. Because you know, a man getting slapped, bro, that's. And did he teach you, you can't to get aim for his nose? <laughs> Are oh, you doing baby boy? Yeah. <laughs> Where are we live? You got to aim for this. Worse, getting Open slapped head. or getting spit at? Oh, spit. Spit. By yeah. 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 Spit. If you, if I, spit that slap, that face. slap is a wake up call. Now, yeah. yeah. Slap, you can almost walk away with dignity. No, not, not slap, almost. It's still fucked up. You can walk up. away with dignity, though. But From if you get slap, spit on, have y'all been like spat on? A spat? Have you been spit on? Damn. Not in the face. I have. But yeah, we had to have my son to die. It was my first game overseas. Oh, yeah. And. I'm fresh off the plane. We can hear y'all. We can hear y'all. We can hear y'all back there. Hey, we can hear y'all. We can hear When you go overseas, like it's a it's a real grind. Like you can get off the plane and have a game Mm -hmm. that day and you better perform. Can't even stretch. Yeah. Dog. So (laughs) we playing the first game. Now it's at our place, but they brought a whole bunch of fans with them. And so I check into the game. I go off a little bit, get a couple buckets, Mm -hmm. playing good defense. They had this little short dude. Like, little stocky short dude. I get in a pick and roll action, Mm -hmm. and I'm fighting over the screen. Homeboy grabs my arm and, like, tries to throw me to the ground. So as I'm falling to the ground, I grab him, and I don't let go, and I just hip toss him over. So now it's a whole little little scuffle. Mm -hmm. So everything breaks up, you know. And I don't talk shit, but once shit like that happens, I zone out, and I'm just talking shit to everybody at that point. And I'm letting you know that I'm cooking your ass. So the dude that's guarding me, I hit him with a couple moves, score on him a couple times, and now I'm talking shit. Mm-hmm. He hauled off and spit nah. right at me, bro. Where did it land? Where did it land? Right here. Oh, man. Damn. Instantly, that's both crazy. of these came up. My teammates grabbed me. And you're in a different country. I'm in a different country. So yeah, all of this is, I'm a yeah, thinker. Yeah. I'm a, In real time, I'm a yeah. thinker. Like, yeah, when yeah. shit get going, cause I, and I think that comes from, like, my military days. Like, you you thinking fast all the time. Well, yeah, yeah. was in the military? I'll get to that another bro, show. Listen, that's, a, that's another show. We, we don't know anything yeah, about I him, bro. I lived a bunch of lives. This nigga's a Marine, bro. We gonna peel the layers back as we go. Okay. I'm not gonna be here when the layers get pulled back. Go ahead. Go ahead. So, yeah, so... This nigga was a teacher. The, the, <laughs> the military. He's a DJ. He's a father. This nigga. What else? He was an NBA player? Yeah. What this nigga call, not, bro? I'm a renaissance man. Yeah, man. This nigga's a classic. He's a nigga. What are you, classic, are you right now? Yeah, so I, in my head, yeah, I'm thinking, all funny. right, this is my first game here. Yeah. I don't want to go home. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If I beat this nigga up, I'm probably going to go home. And it's probably going to be a riot in here because they brought hey. a lot of fans with him. So I had to think fast. And I, I let him make it. Now, we had to play him again. Uh-huh. So this time, I'm like, all right, I got something for him. But you got to do it within the flow of the game. Exactly. So every time I shot a jump shot, he always came, like, under me. Mm-hmm. Bow. Dropped the elbow on top of his head. Yeah. Every single time. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Those, and, those are the like, right dirty on plays. the top, like, right there. The dirty play. Oh, yeah. Shoulder, mm-hmm. everything. Every time he come, every time I come down, I'm yeah, right you gotta there. You got to put that hole right here in his trap. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, the dirty but, plays. That's and, how you got to do it. And I had 30 that game. And we won. And I'm, many on rebound. Road, and I'm talking shit to everybody. Yeah, but Phil know me, bro. Like, mm. I don't say shit on the court yeah, you unless talk. you start talking to me. Yeah. yeah. Thankfully, I've never had anyone spit in my face. I've had bro, people I, spit at me. Okay. And uh, it was yeah, like white boys. You know, uh, white it was boys, the hardest shit I've ever yeah, had yeah, yeah. to like you know, calm myself down from, yeah, bro. White boys go, you I know, you in Oklahoma, you know, white boys get powered up. You know, mm-hmm. they they done, uh, yeah. they got finished you off the farm and shit. Before? Several. Yeah. So they get off the farm and shit. <laughs> <laughs> several. And um, I just want to hear him say it. I'm several. No, yeah. for so. So they get off the farm and they think they tough in school. They wear their cowboy boots and shit. 
you almost got to kill those white boys, though, because they, no, yeah, stop. they don't fucking stop. They don't fucking like stop. stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Come on, motherfucker. You done? Yeah, exactly. And after they bleed, hey, what? I had like, a couple yeah, white homeboys like that in high school. You got punched out, yeah. bro. What are yeah. you doing? Like, like, yeah, I, I had some I, white I, friends like so that in high school, bro. Like, like, you know, you I played football. Punched, bro? I played a football. Lot of so the, the old linemen. Yeah, So we'll go to parties, and sometimes they'll go. Nigga, get, like, we'll get in a fight or whatever. And then the linemen. Like, have our back, but they'll get their ass whooped. But they'll be out there squabbling and shit. They the only niggas bleed. bleed. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Come on. 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 Yeah, I, I'm I'm fearful of those whites. Those nah, are the ones yeah, that you got to be afraid of. Yeah, uh, whites, uh, Mexicans, and mm -hmm. short people. You got to wait, yeah, wait, yait, wait, yait, wait, yait. wait. Where did the short people nah, come short, in? Short nah, people have up. a complex, man. Yeah, like a, a man short ain't going out. <laughs> a, a man like under five five, nigga is dangerous, man. Yeah. I'm telling you, man. That's all you just be mad, bro. And That's what I'm talking about. He's safe. He's safe. He's safe. That nigga ain't going out. I'm just saying that, yeah. but a lot of those Mexicans got hands, though. Man, I, a lot I, of those Mexicans box. Like, I had to figure out who the Mexicans were down here when I moved yeah, down here because the Mexicans different. is different yeah. back home. Yeah. Okay, yeah. you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. Tejanos in here too. It ain't shit. a lot yeah. of you know gangster Mexicans, oh, yeah. and it, you have that, but it ain't as abundant as it is down like here. Houston has when I came, yeah. when I first yeah. moved here, I lived on the southeast side on Broadway, Southwest, right there on Broadway. Uh -huh. So, uh, dog. Once I started seeing, I started seeing all these Hispanic dudes with we can hear with the uh, the Astros mm -hmm. tattoo, and I figured it out quick. Quick, like yeah, oh, that's a, that's a that's a game. That's a game. Yeah, that's a game. They, they don't I just know love. That. They don't just love the yeah, team. Yeah, they're not Astros fans. Yeah, no. they don't. Well, they probably <laughs> are, but that ain't why they got <laughs> the tattoo. They don't just love nah, the yeah, team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're gonna send you to space. That's what they're going to do. Yeah, yeah. Jail though. Because, you know, gang affiliated. Um, Thug. Excellent segue. Oh somehow <laughs> um, made his way out of prison. Yeah. But I think he's still in a prison of himself because 15 <laughs> years probation, <laughs> bro. Let me tell you. Is, yeah, that's yo, crazy. and you can't go to Atlanta. Yeah. Unless, unless no, no, no. He, business, got, he can do. They business. don't live in Atlanta anyway. Yeah. Nobody no, matter, bro. In Atlanta. He can go do a show. So he can do a show. Yeah, he can work. Go back. But 15 years probation feels like a setup. Bro. Yeah, that's crazy. It does. That's it, crazy. It, it does, but freedom. Be, what? That, there's yeah. nothing Come on, man. better than freedom. Bro. Talk about it. it like, that, yeah, that, that, that's that's it, bro. Like, it is steep. 15 years, but hey, y'all got a lawyer. Yeah, we can hear y'all. We can hear y'all. Bro, like, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, yeah. But anyway, I was gonna say. It seems like a setup, but if there's any, if there was any time, you know how people say, man, he should, he should have just did this. He should have just moved away. Dude. If there's no. any time for that, it's right now. Well, he got move it. away. I'm just saying, get out yeah. of the way. Go, go to somewhere. Utah with YB, man. Yeah, somewhere. <laughs> not, not even something like that. Somewhere where it's just like it's a cool little city. People go there, but it's just still safe and it's still what cool if he out came the way. To Houston, Thug he, come to Houston. He bro. could come to Houston. He make a lot I'm of money. I'm just saying, out like. He sh that if if people say that shit all the time, but you gotta get the away. Time is now. You gotta get away. And, and, sure. and a lot of people, I think, when you become successful, especially when you come from the you know the the situation and the backgrounds that a lot of our superstars come from, you gotta move away. By the way, Boosie did it when he got out. He moved away. He moved to Atlanta or Georgia. He you gotta get. That you have to get away from. When he got out of all that shit. He was where in where everybody knows you where everybody knows who you used to be. And then all of the people that know who you are now may not want you to be in that spot. Yeah. So they're going to come after you. I, it's happened with a bunch of the, the young rappers. All of them, basically. Basically. Every young rapper. Leave home. Yeah. Every, Leave. What yeah. was uh, my man named Lil Snoop? Yeah. Yeah, every young rapper. He was that was very unfortunate though. That, that was, was his so fans sad, video bro. Game? Yeah, that was over, that was so sad, over bro. Over, over nothing. nothing. That, was, that was a talented little, little yeah, guy. Oh, oh God, freestyle with the Houston best. Hard, I mean, too. I was looking the other day. They was like, you know, we got a lot of guys. What's my name? Um, um, the guy with the one eye. 
Um, he in prison right now. Oh, uh, um, Fetty Wap. Fetty Wap. He in mm-hmm. prison. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, of course, we got all the his, his regular label did him. All dirty. the people in Chicago who have been shot, killed. Now Dirk in prison. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Cool. Um, like we lost a whole like under thirty yeah. group of musicians. Mm-hmm. A whole lot. A of whole them. lot of them. Man. Yeah. The the fact that he home. I hope he do make music again. Like oh, that's, please. I of hope course. He please. Yeah, I yeah, think so. Got to. Uh, yeah. Bro, I watched that whole trial. Like when I was at work, I would just have it on because I was so interested. Mm-hmm. And it's like, they was like, I heard his uh, lawyer say, it would have been 90 more days before we would have got like a result. But we was, we think Three we Three more win. months, bro. But he was like, though, it was like, bro, I can't do 90 more days. You yeah, because he, I mean? he's sitting I'm just sitting here, bro. Yeah. And he like, if I got a chance to go home right now, please don't let me, I need to go. That's why I'm telling y'all like that 15 year probation, that is crazy. That's crazy. But freedom, bro. Yeah. No, he was facing. Nothing, you can't put no price on freedom. And bro. he was facing life. Like he was going to spend the rest of his life in jail if convicted if of all convicted? this shit, man. Now, what did it, um, off of that, what you talking about? Mm. Remember when Meek Mill was in his thing? Remember, mm-hmm. and then he got he popped the wheelie or some shit, yeah. threw him back. See, they was so after that, him, though. Okay. But yeah. see, I'm thinking about the delicacy of yeah. what he can do and what he can't mm-hmm. do. Mm-hmm. Like, what do y'all expect him to do? I haven't read the parameters of his full probation. I just know kind of the hot button points that everybody knows. He can't be around certain people. Can't be around certain people. He um, has to be around Gunner. Gunner. To make music, bro. Fine. In their contractual. It's contractual. Operated. Yeah. But still. Yeah. You left it open. Whether you fuck with him or not, exactly, you left the bro. door open to yes. Yes. be around him and, and make music with him. Yeah. Dog, yeah. he held the label down. Yeah. I think this- For two I, albums. I think the, the Gunner shit, the Woody shit, and the other guy, I can't I can't uh, remember his name. It was another dude that they highlighted for maybe a week or two mm-hmm. who took the stand. That shit seemed like it was like a part of the, the play. What you mean? Oh, no. Like the- uh, Give him this information here, but when you get in court, flip. Yeah. Oh, nah. Everybody, everybody not, did it. Attorneys because, be smart, too. Now, I, now, now, I don't yeah. know if it but was on money some pressure spent shit. On, bo- on both sides. So who, like, what are you talking, like, what are you talking about? It's a marriage between both sides? No, to- what I'm saying is Woody got into the um, deposition or. Yeah, with the attorney, and then with, he changed the story on stand. And he changed it on the stand. But who are you saying that's being set up by? No, the I think they by, set up the court. They yeah, set, I uh, think they played the whole system. Yeah. I well, think they played the not, entire that's system. Not, I don't think that because, uh-uh. that, like I said, it's being it's money being spent on both sides. They ain't got time the to be. The whole system was Woody. Yeah, he started yeah, so I'm saying, all I think, of it. I think he just did that. That was him doing that. It. Was him or he ain't orchestrated no way, all of that? This is the what's the yeah. the uh, uh, the oldest. The, I mean, longest. the longest uh, trial. trial. Yeah, ain't nobody spending all that money bro. and playing around, playing with the public. The little Woody nigga. Or- but if it, but if it nigga just had an epiphany and just started. But if it's to the benefit of Thug, why not? We gonna spend that bread. We gonna, How's it I'm benefit? gonna keep playing. He's free. Nigga, he sat in jail for th- how long he been in there? I get but that. It's than life. But it's better than better spending life. the rest of your life in jail and okay, I gotta sit down. Gunner, you say this. And you think... They let you out Thug so you can keep making money. This shit? I think so. No fucking way. Nah, nah, hell, hell no. Nah, hell, <laughs> nah, hell, nah, hell, nah. Hell, nah. Nigga nah. want to be home. That, that, that Woody nigga. Bro. But I'm saying, no, what I'm, what I'm saying is he was not coming home. The, they had him. Like. They didn't. They, they had him as far as you don't get bail and you got to sit down. They got you there. Yeah. So how can we play this for the long term? All right, Woody, you said this. Now I need you to go say this on the stand. And it didn't help that the district attorney got caught up in that Trump shit. And then who was fucking because who? Because she was the main thing. Like, Wasn't somebody messing with that's somebody? That's what I'm saying. But that was on the Trump side yeah. of the case. But she's still the district attorney. So that hurt the credibility mm-hmm. of the court also. Yeah. So Listen, a lot that, of shit got that, hurt. That, that, that shit, new judge that was shit, trying to get that shit over with. Basically. Yeah. Yeah. That, yeah. Shit, that shit was not, um, it was not orchestrated like that, bro. It was like, uh, Woody started it, right? They wanted Thug, right? They didn't really have nothing. They Remember, they was, they was watching this man for 15 years. <laughs> like watching this man tapping phones, all kind of stuff. So Woody was providing them, or however you pronounce his name, with information about Thug because he know that they wanted him. Y'all see he kept going in and out of jail. So when bro got on the stand, he was just like, I told him whatever I wanted to tell him to get me out of trouble. Mm-hmm. He really manipulated the yeah. whole system. I think it was just like, the whole case around Thug was built on bullshit. Mm-hmm. They ain't everything, have nothing solid. They, they was really winning. Yeah. They, he just couldn't wait no longer. Yeah. 
That whole case was based this on nigga, bullshit. Hey, Dateline NBC. Yeah. Yeah, he know all the facts. Hey, yeah. to, to end it off, I would in. say if we had a hood nigga Hall of Fame, Thug is in it. He, yeah, he didn't say nothing. He did not. He, he didn't say ain't, shit. You know what I'm saying? Held it down. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And he don't get nothing for that. He don't get nothing for that. But when you the, 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 the top guy, who do you tell is, on? Like, there's nobody to tell on. tell on. There's nobody to tell on. Streets is over. Streets is done. Did y'all watch the Megan doc? I did. Okay. I did not. Uh, I, I I watched it today, actually. Yes, bitch, I lied to Gail King, bitch. First of all, I know that bitch was even gonna ask me about that shit. Bitch, she's always gonna talk about the shooting. Why'd you ask me about fucking Tory? That's not what this is about. Even if I was, I fucked this nigga like once, maybe twice on a drunk night. Bitch, you kept catching me out of my fucking mind. Too much okay, ass. would you like would you like to get one minute on the Megan doc <clears throat> and not discuss anything about Megan's looks? Go ahead. Hold, hold up, on, let me, hold up, hold up. Let me take it. Let me take it. Let me take a little break because that was the first thing. I know. That's what I said. We, let's focus on <laughs> let's her. Let's get talent. this out the way. No, Meg looks good. <laughs> <laughs> she looks fucking amazing. Now, as far as the documentary is concerned, I think we got to see the other side of everything because I know for me, a lot of the information I was consuming was like very pro Tory. You know what I'm saying? From the podcast I listened to to you know, the the music that was coming out, like, it's really sad for me as a music fan to see one, Meg's music took a dip mm -hmm. because of everything. Obviously, like, you got shot, you got the whole world telling you you're this horrible person, and you didn't do anything but get shot. Mm -hmm. No matter who did it, like, I, I still don't know who did it. I don't know if it was Kelsey or Tori, whatever. That's not important. The fact that Tori was coming out with some of the most amazing music around that time. Yeah. Like Scat came out around that time. Um, Broken a Minute, Chicks Tape 5. Like all of this great music came out. Talented, man. And we, we as consumers and fans selfishly, we got robbed of a lot. But to see the other side of everything for me, to see her kind of like she broke down. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And and I understood it because in your heart of hearts, you really feel like like you're a victim in this thing. Like mm -hmm. at the end of the day, nobody got hurt but her. Yeah. And then all of the 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 fodder and the commentary and the IG comments and anything she posted, she's getting troll messages of it. the part that really fucked me up was people commenting like, oh, he should have shot you in the head. I'm like, oh, somebody said that, bro. A bunch of people, of course, of a course. bunch oh, of people. Oh, there were people oh. like on video, like saying, "Oh, he, if he did shoot you, he shot you in the wrong spot." Damn, of course. Yeah, that's wild. And I'm like, how do you say something about a human like that? Because and if he, <laughs> the that's internet crazy, is crazy, bro. The internet the is internet crazy. Is. Tori don't know you. You're not getting no extra points. You're not getting paid. He's not doing nothing for you to defend him like that. And it's just, it, it, it's a sad situation all around because you have these these two young black artists who had the potential to, and Meg is, you know, she's still on her trajectory to yeah. go where she is, but it definitely, definitely. They're going to be married to this situation for the rest of for the rest of their, their careers. Oh, yeah. Definitely. And whenever Tory gets out, you know, he going to face the same shit. Like, it's like going to be a struggle Brown for him Rihanna, to get back. It's going to be, that's are always going to be a thing. Are they coming out with a doc for real about Chris Brown? I, I guess. I'm not watching. I, I don't they, know. I, I, I haven't they, heard it. I hope they don't. Hope but, they don't. yeah, it, like Chris, Chris Brown's supposed to be way oh, well, yeah. bigger than yeah, what Chris Brown be out of here. Because his music, his music yeah. doesn't match where he is, hold up, hey, let me hold up real quick. Hey, y'all yeah. hey, gonna get y'all? We gonna no, we love y'all. <laughs> y'all gonna get y'all podcast after our yes, podcast? Yeah, we got y'all. Got got we got y'all. Mm -hmm. Talk, no so, work. Yeah, we got y'all. <laughs> yeah. All right, good. But yeah, the 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 whole thing is just sad. The documentary was pretty well put together. Um, How long is it? It's an hour. It's uh, almost two hours. It's the running time is like an hour and fifty two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> 
this nigga Phil can't sit still for 20 minutes, man. <laughs> if it ain't a Martin episode, he out. <laughs> hey, I want to say nah, something. Nah, but it was, well, it was well produced. Very it, it, extremely Meg, biased yeah. and pro-Meg. Yeah, but should be. I learned a little bit about her that I didn't know. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I need to see his I never knew what Kelsey looked like. So, I, I've never seen her before. And you got to I'm see their relationship down. prior to. Um, but yeah. I'm kidding. It was a good documentary overall, man. Good yeah. documentary. Make sure you catch all that. <laughs> okay. What okay. you right. say, JC? Um, I seen uh shout out Big Slim. I seen he was getting uh Who the hell is Big Slim? Nigga, Slim Thug. Oh, Slim my fuck. I, that's I another thing. It was a new nigga. That's another that's shit. another black thing. What? Oxymoron nicknames. Big Slim. Oh. They don't even go together. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Big Mike! I got yeah. I know no, a couple big. You Mikes. can't be How Big you Mike. Big? Yeah. How you big ass that, Slim? That's not an oxymoron. You can't be Big Mike. <laughs> huh? He said you can't be oh, big, big and Slim. slim. Oh, big yeah, slim. Big, big and slim. slim. Yeah, I feel you. Yeah. <laughs> Little tiny, yeah, tiny. No, yeah. little no, tiny works. No, that no, works. No. Get out of here. Big Sean, Sean don't, don't work. No. Y'all not understand Big Tiny don't how this work. works? Like, what are we doing right now? Big Sean would be hey, doing John, like, no, he's a small guy. Sean, his John, put the definition of oxymoron on the screen. No, that doesn't matter. He can get big. Like, so he can oh, be like Big Sean. Or he can be talking about his feed or anything. Like, he's big. And what was his name? Big Slim? Big and Slim don't go together. Yeah, I feel you. Yeah, blacks do stuff like that. Yeah. We do. We do. Yeah, I'm tired of the blacks. But anyway, I seen he was being uh sometimes <laughs> he got uh he got uh they was going after him because he came after uh the people that was going for Tory and all the bullshit that happened people was talking about it that documentary and he was just coming to the defense of Megan and people was reposting this shit. I just want to say, well, Slim from that, H-Town. That's what I'm saying. It's just an H. I don't even like thing. talking about it. I don't no, either. I really and don't this either. is what I'm gonna say. Look, look. Let me. This is what I'm gonna say. And we said this before when shit happened in Houston. A lot of shit been happening over the years yeah. in Houston, and we be here. So I'm just saying, like now that we're in this internet era, to the public, Houston has the culture in Houston has always been like y'all here to play a shit, but that's really what it is. Mm -hmm. Like. Y'all don't know that niggas meet up to fight and shit. Like, it, we only know about it because this, we in this new era of everybody got a phone. Like, mm -hmm. you only gonna hear about shit that happened in Houston if niggas want to entertain what entertains you, if that makes sense. Like, if if Maxo or a Sauce Walker do an interview, if they want to say some shit, they'll say, it. they'll say it and then you'll just, they'll just entertain it. But this is more to it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But we don't just be talking and shit like that. Nah. So about this Meg situation, it's like, it's fucked up. Like, and we really don't know all the facts, but it's just like, yeah, man, we Houston people just don't be gossipy like that. Man, yeah, because you can, because yeah, yeah. the shit can get dangerous. To be honest, yeah, I'm not prayers talking, for everybody, man. And then prayers I'm to everybody. About, do y'all have plans? To vote on election day if you haven't voted already. We already yeah, did. Yeah, I'm gonna go vote. You already voted. I already did. You, 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 did, you, you did. election day type nigga? Yeah. I, I'm gonna go do it. This is the first time I've early I was, voted. I have been busy, but this is the first voted? time I, this is the first time I've early voted. Okay. I had to do a limited ballot because I moved and all of that stuff. Trump but... plus one. You early voted? No. I already voted. <laughs> I already voted. Okay. I'm definitely voting for Kamala. We don't we don't know, brother. I definitely we don't know. voted for Kamala. You're not wearing you're not wearing you love black definitely. women shirt today. So you we don't know. Yeah, you got a shot to all my sisters. Oh, you black look, women. Come you on, look man. real MAGA right now. What's going on? Like, come on, man. Hey, you're not about to put that yeah, on me. Yeah, bro. Like, we, we don't Hell know. No. Fuck up this uh, I ain't even in a tax started. bracket that makes sense for me to that, vote for uh, Trump. We, we Until the next election. So, but yeah, I saw I saw my man Sly on there. I was like, oh, I'm voting for him, and I didn't see him on my ballot. So, so Phil, um, w when will you be voting? Are you voting on election day? Probably, clearly, probably. Yeah. Are you gonna go before or after work? Phil is not going. No, he going says after doing, work, he's I'm not. Going, he's not voting. Not going. You're not voting. You, no, You're not voting. You get time. Yeah, we get. We get. That yeah. gives us three hours. You get three. Oh, okay. you, what you gonna do with your three hours? He you gonna know? take twenty uh, minutes you know? to vote. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a little round of I ain't know that you took the do rag. Nigga did take the do rag. Yeah, he tried to show the waves. Yeah, he tried to show the waves. I saw him doing this because he had a line. I was like, what are you doing right now? I rubbed the line out. That nigga rubbed the line out. Phil is a player, man. Yeah, yeah. That nigga said, let me do it. It's my time. Uh, what else we got to talk about? I don't about have much else to talk about. I ain't got shit to talk about. Lil Wayne, Lil Wayne, Lil Wayne. I'm ready I'm to ready. be off the pod. Lil so Wayne. What are we doing? Lil, Lil Wayne. Wayne. 
Lil's Weezy. I didn't did y'all watch, watch one of that shit. I didn't it, it already happened. We it already know. happened yesterday. We don't know anything about I, it. I, I, I watched it. it. Uh, I know you. Why do you have so much time to watch so much Lil television? Lil's Weezy. Because it's Wayne. Yeah, it's if Wayne, it ain't Wayne bro. or Jay Z, he yeah, ain't got for nah, twenty Wayne minutes for you. Man, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just like Aaron, all of them got back together. It that did, was cool. Oh, that Cowboy reunion. Oh yeah, they had everybody. They have Turk. They performed yeah, together. together. Okay. Yeah, they, they, they performed together. Yeah, the last time Wayne was by yeah, himself and, was and then it was his mother. They all was yeah, there. Yeah, that's love. That that's Everybody love. came on stage. She was love live. That shit was good. I like that. They gave him the. Uh, a, I guess they doing a no lie walk of fame, and he's like, oh, Lil is the first one. Master P presented it to him. Master that, P should have been the first. Nah. That, that's fire. Well, no, nah, well, Lil Wayne is bigger than Master P. Well, yeah, but I'm saying Master P was first. If we don't have, I I feel like. And, and you know things can happen different ways or whatever. But if Master P isn't Master P, right? We don't have Baby and we Slim, rock, feel you? which we don't have Wayne. You know what I'm saying? Like P, P should have been the first one. Right, right, right. We gonna but put anybody just, on another know, Hall of Fame? I think he got to be next. I think it's only right that they did it like that. It, yeah, like, he giving he, it to Wayne, yeah, right? Because yeah. yeah. Cause but you gotta give you nah, gotta I give family tree. that um, Baptiste nigga. What's his name? Um, Jean Baptiste, who um, played that he win Emmys and shit all the time. Grammys. Okay, yeah, uh -huh. that's okay, who's gonna okay, be okay. next. Then get mad. Master P about five down. Is it always yeah, one of the guys? Nah, Master P, P that nigga, bro. bro. Come on, Master P that nigga. Does King Orleans? person need to be next? No. He no. from New Orleans? No. Well, oh, oh, okay. Yeah, I see what you say. He said on a broader like, scale. Fuck them down. Master, Master P is Master on a broader scale, bro. Them sugar yeah, ass smoothies, man. No. Man, I'm just saying that's one of the biggest things in the world. Master P put out a movie on the weekend of Star Wars. It wasn't number one, though. Yes, so it was. Nah, no it's way. No yes, way. it was. It could Go not be Star Wars. Go look, look it up. up. John, it was John. You're lying. It was John. John. Look it up. In certain, in certain markets. No, no, you can't oh, say certain, certain markets. No, 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 no Oh, was it the other one? I know. Foolish. 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 Wow. It wasn't number one. No, not at all. Nah, Foolish. Star Wars made a whole It was like, it was a whole movie. Movie. I'm telling y'all, hey, Foolish was a whole movie. movie. I, like, I believe I'll it. beat Star Wars in a couple of Foolish seasons. is horrible. It did, it did, they, had, they had to shop it. <laughs> they didn't beat Star Wars anywhere. I don't believe that. I'm not going to believe that. They had to shop it like that they shopped their music Wars because Master they didn't have no backing. They didn't have no backing, so they had to come out their own money to shop the Yeah, they may have made some money, but I think you just had a little extra sauce on <laughs> you said no, bro. it was number one. They in the made country. more yeah. than what they were supposed to make. They definitely did because I saw that one. movie. Yeah. I'm just saying that the same master. But this is when guy. niggas were still going to the movies, though. and that was one of the worst black. But movies. for him what? to even him to even do that, bro, to that make a Soul movie. Plane. No, Soul Plane is one of the worst master black movies P. too. But no, I Soul Plane is so the worst Perry. black movie. Well, you tripping now? It's one of the worst master black movies. Master P. Walk. So Tyler Perry. No, no, no. Tyler Perry was doing stage plays. He was. It's different. But Master P got to the big screen first, independently. I got the hookup. I don't know. I got to look. That's a high quality movie. There might, be, there, there might That's be other blacks black who did. Film. There's some other blacks who. Out of Sidney Poitier should have had some film. shit on. No. Like he kissed the white woman first. So you no, know what no, I'm saying? He's like, an actor. I'm talking about from music, from your, from your own independent yeah. thing. And there got to be another black before Master No, P. he was the first. No. There has to be. Bro, he P was the had first. noodles. P got chips. Now. P now. Got, I'm talking about had a cell phone. But he wasn't the first to get a cell phone company. like that deal is that nigga, bro. I believe that. I love P. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, P that dude. I still listen to Bourbon Select every day. If so the, the crazy thing is, is the, homies in the, the crazy thing is if Master oh, P God. was from 2010 to now, we'd be having a whole different conversation. We'd wow. be having a Jay Z P Diddy. Oh, I see. He'd be a like he would be yeah. bigger than yeah. all of them yeah. niggas oh, because yeah. think yeah. of yeah. Sure. think of all of the innovation innovative yeah. shit. He was dropping an album a week. Yeah. Yeah. Had. Niggas on Nickelodeon. Dog, the them gaudy week, ass bro. album covers was bro, popping I'm up. About the subs and Sam was doing. Goody every yeah. fucking every, every Tuesday. He really was on the shelf just like Sean John, just like Rockwell, just like. Hey, like, bro, listen. The man but from New played Orleans. NBA basketball. Yo, that's, yo, that's Charlotte it. fucking Hornets. He played a game, bro. Toronto. He Gavel Toronto. Bang. Toronto. Bro, I thought it was Charlotte. And Charlotte. Charlotto. And Charlotte. Charlotte. It was Charlotte, too. But I thought he played a game, He did it though. twice. One time twice. he scored a bucket, and I was like, yo, that's crazy. He had a jump shot. Bro, yeah, he, that's crazy. Bro. Hey, man. The man, bro, he did some to, shit, bro. Shout out to Percy Miller, man. He pulled off the biggest high hip-hop I've ever seen with Mystical. Got Mystical from his deal. That was a big thing back in the day. Nigga get uh, Snoop. Oh, yeah. Huh? He got Snoop. He got Snoop from yeah. his dick. That was the, What's up? That was the one. Yeah, Snoop was it. Dre over there. We got nothing but loot. That shit was hard, yo. <laughs> nah, yeah, that, that was hard. Yeah, Niggas, yeah, it was Snoop yeah, side with cash hard. money. I was confused, one. No limit. No, no, no limit. Yeah, no limit. No limit. My bad. No disrespect. No limit. But yeah, when he signed with No Limit, I was like, 
And what? You know, Snoop, get out and, there, and Snoop started making flicks. I'm talking about because oh, of Oh, yeah. yeah. You I forgot about like, He was, was in Hot Boys. Boy. Yeah, he was in Hot Boys. He started making flicks. And then he started making his shit. Master P is that guy. Snoop is a too, though. He is. But Master P is that guy. Snoop is the most famous black person in the world. Snoop supersedes everyone, bro. Yeah. In the world, Snoop is the most famous black person in the world, bro. I'm telling you. When you. Kuwait, Qatar. Yeah. All these places that I've been to, they bro. Love Snoop. Everybody you know loves what? Snoop. Uh, I'm gonna say one more thing about P. On, and I was watching Cent. that documentary. They said they he had a building, like a uh, like a little renovation building, whatever. Every room had studios and shit. So all them artists he had, you know how I was. Remember back in the day, they was coming out with them albums every like, week, every week, time. Yeah. every week, nigga. They was running that place like a damn assembly line with music. So that's why they was coming out with all that music. P. Bro, no. when I was a kid, bro, nigga I used to, used to wake up and <laughs> see that, uh, Oscar. that make them say, uh, video. Like, that was one of the liveest videos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In that gym? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Shaq was in the tank in the gym. That was one because of the liveest the videos. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. But look, I'm done with this pod today. This yeah, is, yeah, uh, yeah, we this, good. I don't care about anything else. We supposed we had a fan note, but I, I can't find it. What was the fan it. note? Someone had emailed us, so maybe we'll get to that after. We're going to talk about that with Raymond. Watch with Raymond. Third. You said what? I'm not going to talk about the wine right now. Um, we're about to listen to some. Goddamn, we, John, we, you we, trying we to set us up? We do have some, <laughs> we do have some um, Jay Harden of 2020 California red wine. Um, I'm going to leave it open to interpretation about if it was delicious or not. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> we out. We out. <laughs>